When it comes to playing as a survivor, sometimes you just have to do the heavy lifting for your teammates. That's why today I decided to make a build that will protect my teammates, basically, and give them more chance to escape. In case, you know, they're not that good. Babysitter. For you, maybe it has a different name, but it's a Steve Harrington perk. When you unhook a survivor, they won't leave scratch marks or pool of blood, and they gain a 7% haste status effect for 8 seconds. And you see the killer's aura for 8 seconds. Now, to go with this, I decided to put will make it. When you rescue a survivor from a hook, gain a 100% speed increase while healing others for 90 seconds. What that means is, whenever I unhook a survivor, I can see the killer where he is. So if he comes to the hook, I'm gonna let the survivor go and he can just run, has plenty of time to go to a pallet or you know, to a safe loop. But if the killer is far away and I see he doesn't come to the hook, I can instantly heal them in no time. Smash it. After stunning a killer with a pallet, break into a sprint at 150 your normal running speed for four seconds. Now I know this is not the best exhaustion perk, but I want to use something different. We're gonna live forever. When healing another survivor in the dying state, your healing speed is increased by 100%. Additionally, performing any of the following action activates the perk's secondary function. Perform a safe hook, take a hit to protect the survivor, rescue a survivor by stunning the killer with a pallet, rescue a survivor by blinding the killer. When this perk's secondary function is active, healing another survivor out of the dying state grants them endurance for 10 seconds. Now I know this is not the best combination when it comes to, you know, protecting survivors. I know you have like other perks like for the people, or buckle up, you name it, but I wanted to use something different. But of course, let me know your build in the comments down below because I'm not the best survivor around here, okay guys? You guys may know better than me, but I just like to share uh, fun stuff because I love the game. Let me know your fun builds in the comments down below. Let's see what we can do. The goal here is not necessarily for me to survive, it's for my teammates to survive, right? I am playing with a friend, which is uh, Kathleen1997. He doesn't speak English, so therefore he's not gonna be able to hear or understand what I'm saying, but I'm talking with you guys. If I can make him <laughs> escape, then my mission is uh, complete because he's a total noob when it comes to Dead by Daylight. Fortunately, our friend is already down, so he has friends till the end. I'm not really surprised because we're playing against Chucky. The thing is, uh, with uh, friends till the end, he can see my arm. But I don't think he's coming after me though. And he's picking him up, which is good. We can make a very fast heal. Now he can see me. He cannot down with his special, but I don't want to get a no, give him a free hit, right? Yeah, I'm gonna go for a hook. Okay. I need to pay attention to the skill check though, not only to see his aura. Yeah, so far I'm doing a very bad job in protecting Kathleen because he's on his second hook. But I'm gonna hide in the locker because uh, friends still the end, you know. I need to counter his his perk. Okay. So we're there at the shock. In all honesty, you can just rock these two perks, uh, Babysitter with will make it. And the other two perks can be whatever you want and still do very good and still be able to protect your teammates very well. Yeah, I'm gonna go in the locker. <laughs> Dwight is going in the locker as well for no reason. I mean, he's a Dwight, right? Okay. We have to, we have to keep in mind that friends till the end is very, very strong. <laughs> As you can see, he's looking. He can't see anything. All right, Mineta. <laughs> Okay, we good. Kathleen is dead. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much failed to protect him. Need to save Samir because he's on his last hook. So we cannot afford losing him as well. Okay, there he is. I'm just gonna go in front of him. Okay, there we go. Come after me now. I don't know exactly how he plays. Could be very good. Okay, we I think we're good. Okay, the range on that and the hitbox, it's pretty nuts. Wait, at least Seminator is fine now. There you go, baby. Beautiful. Now we're gonna go back to that gen. Ooh, okay, no, no, no. I'm not taking a risk anymore. That lunge is just insane. Okay, hopefully Mike is gonna go on the gen. I'm gonna try and hold him as much as possible. You gotta be more careful now. We still have a pal here, yes. Okay. Mm 
Man, he's so small I cannot see him. <laughs> Balance to the face, man. <laughs> he activated his uh, special ability, so I cannot see his red glow. However, I know I can heal his giggling, right? I think I s escaped him. Somehow, I don't know. He's probably going to the other gen there. He wants to protect the gens. What are you doing? No, I, I, I'm gonna have to complete the gen. There you go. At least Mike should escape, but if he stood there, we could have completed it much faster. And it won't, it won't be necessary to take a hit by now. Okay, Mikey boy. Hopefully it was not for nothing. Damn. Can't make that. That's fine though. Mike will be able to escape. Yeah, friends till the end. Unfortunately, the last game, we did a pretty bad job in protecting our teammates. I don't have a Bubba. Oh, man. All right. Doing good? Yeah, we're gonna go for uh, for the heal. Hopefully, he's gonna play it more safely. And we're gonna try and get this gen. Hopefully, we can complete this. Okay, never mind. He becomes pure. He's a mad lad. Hopefully he's come, he comes after me. Yes. Hiding behind the generator finally worked for uh, for Dwight. Hmm. I could have gone going around one more, but I wanted to use uh, smash it. See, this is why you should use other perks. But I, I know I just want to use perks like these, like they're more niche. It's more fun. Okay, this is a very, very bad spot that he got me here. And I'm pretty much 100% dead, but it's fine. We might still pull this off. Oh, he comes back, obviously. Hopefully he comes after me. Okay. Mm. He's after Sa Oh boy! We have this battle here. I think we're good. Okay. Gonna let it. Am I gonna waste it? God, I wish I had balance landing. Right. Oh, I'm still fine. Or not? Nope. Right. Uh. What are you doing? Okay, now I'm gonna use it. I think we're good. Let's go back on that uh, gen. Pressure is high, but I think we're gonna be able to do it. Right. Oh, beautiful. Damn it. Man, I'm, I'm so bad at doing my job, like, in protecting <laughs> my teammates. Come. He wants to let me go? No way I get this like with a bubble, right? I'm just gonna say I do not deserve it. <laughs> let me go for a nice little suck it. Okay, he, do he doesn't like it. Yeah, appreciate it. This time we have the Naughty Bear as a killer. He's definitely coming here. Ooh. Baby, go too fast, boy. Yeah, I'm very athletic for an old man. Back on the gen, finally managed to do one gen. What do we have here? What is this arm? It oh, great. If you disarm it, <laughs> he actually got into his old trap. I think we're safe, right? No, but I'm still gonna go for it. Just run. Run, you have speed boost. You have a speed boost. Yes. There you go. What do you... What is my teammate doing? Where are you at? Where are you at? Where are you at? Oh, there you are. Oh, he, he comes here. Not gonna be able to make it. Well, I'm gonna stun you. 
and it's still gonna be good enough for us to escape. I'm just gonna go for the save again. This is gonna be fine if it doesn't screw this up. Okay. That was just a terrible attempt. So he has a Mori. It's beautiful. He searched in the lockers. I think we got this. Yeah, I should probably reconsider my build. 